Hi everyone, this is Lo, and I'm going to cast this claustrophobia game. Here we have in the top left Jesus Corp as Cybron and only Cybron in this game. Turkish noob, UEF and only UEF in this game. Lucian, Seraphim and Kaiser is Aeon. All different factions going to find fight for the middle of this map and actually fight will begin super early because of those almost 2000 wrecks here and 72 tank wrecks. Actually there are a lot of wrecks just on the way to the middle. <clears throat> Not super symmetrical though but that's fine. So, uh, let's go. So, uh, maybe somebody doesn't even know what the hell is claustrophobia is. So, we're supposed to see red lines here. We have preparation time and it seems like a couple minutes. Jesus Corp getting this max and this max should go to T2 immediately. Maybe as well as this one. But you should not upgrade your core make maxes to T2. And you should try to reclaim uh, maxes, uh, reclaim stuff close to the edges as fast as you can. That's a good idea by Kaser. And try to build all your resources as close to the middle of the base as you can and Lucian is the one who has highest rating here and he's the one who is getting middle mass he's also surrounding Nexus with uh, pigeons so he can get his <clears throat> upgrades cheaper he is um, wasting some mass which is a little bit strange I saw him like getting super high on mass even without reclaiming <laughs> so Lucian is uh, getting pretty far ahead right in the beginning Jesus Corp is lowest rated here but he has very good idea of building his power generators closer to the middle Lucian seems to be thinking that uh, shrinking will not happen so fast so he will be fine by just upgrading everything that he has I think uh, T2 ACU and uh, sieging weapons like MMLs and artillery is very good in this matchup so preparation time is expiring Turkish Noob is constructing a ton of T1 units and is getting T2 on his ACU. Jesus Corp is not really doing much. He has T2, however, so he can BD creep. Kaiser and Loxy mostly echoing. Kaiser and Kaiser getting T2. Loxy is getting T2 land and he probably wants to echo even more. Nice bomber by Kaser. Uh, I didn't notice how many kills, but about seven kills. Strange that Luke Luxy is not going for even more mass. Getting a little bit attacked by yellow player Turkish Nope. Turkish Noob started his T2 Pigeon. <laughs> Kaiser is getting Tech 3 upgrade. That's a very nice plan here. Luxy seems to be relying much more on pure eco. Oh, unfortunately, Jesus Corp is fighting Turkish Noob. They, they are both players with least chances. Okay, so for some reason we don't see shrinking uh, lines. That's a bit unfortunate, but map already shrink once, or no, it's even more more than once. It shrink more than once. 
So again, as I said, Jesus Corp has very good idea what he's supposed to do. He already grabbed the middle and tried to hold it. Luxy and others have a different type of plan. They are kind of making a timing attack when they no longer can uh, can stay in their base. They will uh, then they will go ahead and leave their bases and. Uh, fight for the middle, they are not fighting for the middle straight up. Uh, Jesus Corp, by the way, seems to be having Seton's eco mod, I saw him, his ACU being paused. He's got some reclaim from this T1 land over here. Uh, Turkish Nook, however, not moving his T2 ACU to the middle. Not sure what case he will do, he is getting to air maybe he wants to transport himself to the middle because it's faster than walking I don't know or maybe he wants to make a tech 3 ACU drop to the to someone's base we have shrink number four soon so far oh top side is actually a little bit of disadvantage it seems I don't know if their maxes will disappear faster than maxes of Fluxy and Kaser Jesus Corp successfully taking middle, but he should, if only he had T2 Pigeon, so he could, could use all this reclaim here. Actually still can use all this reclaim. He's, he's constructing a ton of gestures. His PDs are not greatest for this uh, terrain, it is very unfortunate. Um, Luxy has flag here, uh, Kaser is planning drop. He's planning to drop to the middle and probably... No, I don't know. Drop to the... Lucian's base. Lucian is in the middle of Tech 3 land upgrade. He's starting to retreat with his ACU. Does Kaser has enough uh, mass for PDs? Yes, he does. He should not waste time making walls, I think. Should just go ahead and build a ton of PDs and should rally his units to the enemy base and maybe make T1 bombers. O only 4 PDs are built, but maybe he's uh, actually running out of mass. It seems like it. Lucian doesn't know what to do, he's deciding to start working on power one PD died Kaser immediately getting it back he should reclaim everything around him yes it is extremely fast to reclaim with tech 3 ACU doesn't even cost anything maybe could attempt to capture one uh, thing here so Kaser is doing good job uh, kicking Lucian out of the game. Let's see if Kaser pays attention here and can kill this artillery. Well, ACU does it auto automatically. Um, Jesus Corp still holding middle and trying to jester snipe Turkish Nob. But Turkish Nob is reacting and from all his factories producing T1 anti-air and with this T2 UFACU it should be good enough. I think Jesters will barely not snipe this Turkish knob. However, Kaser here is a little bit I mean, he's, he maybe thinks that his only enemy is Luxy, but he's maybe underestimating uh, 
uh, Jesus Corp and Turkish Knob because eventually he will have to deal with them if, if one of them hold in the middle so Kaser does have overcharge I think um, again I don't see it he does not have overcharge he built it with ACU because that was the fastest possible way and 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 come on he's losing a lot of HP this factory should have been gone long time ago he will try to rebuild his TTPD he should just kill his factory T1 artillery is the greatest counter yes he gets this and need to prepare to overcharge or he will get in trouble so oh he's trying to escape here I don't think Luxi will try to uh, control K himself yeah tank was maybe focusing on the transport but transport has still too much HP Luxi should try and make one tech 3 engineer and escape with it so now Kaser Kaiser is a very good player, however, he, this max is not even T2 here. And his stuff is getting demolished and he is not paying attention to reclaim parts of his base before they are uh, getting out of uh, this thingy. Jesus Corp is holding in the middle, but the only thing he's got is T2 PDs and doesn't even have uh, anti-air here shields so uh, Kaser is relying on T2 air to clear out the middle he doesn't have enough resources to oh he does it's just being built slowly I don't know what should Kaser what Kaser should do here maybe um, Build a freaking mass fabricator? I don't know, of course, first of all, need to upgrade this one uh, to T2 and uh, Tech 3, as well as maybe uh, this one where Selene is. So, every player is doing PG creep to the middle and Luxy lost his pigeon. No, he should rebuild pigeons and reclaim stuff in the main base like this to two power so he can get enough power for his stuff. He has one tank, but he was trying to build a transport here. But it's all getting attacked here. So Kaser has most chances here of winning. He killed Lucian he And meanwhile, those two guys were fighting each other, so now he clear out the middle. He built PDs on the low ground, so not sure if that's so good decision. Usually people rely on RAS upgrade on claustrophobia maps, but of course in this situation it's a very small map and you can't do that I don't know why he's not reclaiming his stuff maybe he has enough mass uh, I wouldn't say so so Jesus Corp got killed in between PDs of Kaser and Turkish no Lucian is giving up Oh, actually, I thought walls mean that, but he's not trying to reclaim anything to get uh, his power back up faster. So it seems like uh, Kaser had the best plan for this game with uh, super OP. Wow, with super OP ACU drop and with just T2 PD creep, he will able to outgun anyone in this game 
so I, I'd say well played Kaser. He has, uh, he still has two pigeons. He has three pigeons, so I guess rest is not option. But uh, you could uh, make some shields. Looks like no one is a threat right now, and eventually everyone else will be forced into range of those T two PDs, and. Luxie will win. Yeah, even constructing tech to artillery at this point. Oh, Lucian has double TML here. Kaiser might know about it because he has his insane vision range. Well, no, he doesn't. Oh, it has more than... Uh, oh, right now it has... Uh, no, it's done. You need 40 ML to kill that ACU. Or you need... He needs his own. Luxi, he needs to ace his own ACU to explode and all three missiles to hit, and then he might be able to. Oh! Turkish Nuk gave all his stuff to Kaiser. Oh, uh, he had only one try and he missed. So uh, at least at least Luxy didn't give up, and he actually tried to get uh, TMLs and snipe uh, Kaiser. Actually, Kaiser brought himself down to thirteen thousand HP, so even two TMLs. Uh, could make it okay was nice game thanks for watching